So is it a show now? <laughs> it's a show. Nina Dobrev, welcome. Welcome to my office Thank here you. at Rolling Stone, where I always have this poster. Oh. It just sits waiting for you to arrive. No, that's not true. I've, You're calling me a liar <laughs> first? Day? Wow. Wow. You as mean, much as I would love to think that, that um that I, that Ian, Paul, and I stare at you all day, every day, mm -hmm. sweating and dripping mm -hmm. And how do you drip mattress. like that? How was that done <laughs> so that you get the sweat and drip? Were you sprayed? Um, no, we had to run laps around the studio <laughs> yeah. for about 45 minutes. At, at, at the 47th minute, they let us lay on the bed and just like... And then it just seems sexual and enough. <laughs> exactly. Yeah, that, that, for those people that aren't watching Vampire Diaries, and you're all fools if you're not. Well, there, yeah, there's nobody that doesn't. Yeah, so I don't show. really care about them. Yeah, we. But <laughs> just for that little one or two that doesn't know who you're playing, you are Elena, human yes. in every way. But then you're Catherine. You know, mm -hmm. Elena's just the doppelganger. Catherine is how many hundred years old? Uh, 500 years old now, and she, we just found out, is also a doppelganger. This, she's the first doppelganger, so apparently there's another one before her. God, I wish I could be a doppelganger of somebody on that show. No, you don't. But these guys, Paul and Ian, they, you know, they play one part. Yeah. Sometimes there's a flashback until we see back in the Civil War or something, but you got two parts. These guys do nothing. They don't... Come yeah, on, they, they admit do, it. They, do, they look pretty, okay? They Let's do. Be serious. They, they do. Look I'm looking really, at really that. They're, they're doing that. And it's exhausting. <laughs> it's, it's, <laughs> it's exhausting. <laughs> look at him. He looks exasperated. He's like, oh my God, it's so to beautiful. to do that. Yeah. <laughs> you have to go switch on and off from that. Like, if I said to you, you're Elena now, what would I be seeing? Oh, that's a lot of pressure. Yeah. Um, I don't know. I... But it doesn't happen every day. They say, you're Elena now. Yeah. I would have to... Constantly be worried about something, and Peter, are you okay? Are you okay, Peter? Oh, Peter, you're gonna be fine. I'm worried. It's okay, it's okay, we're gonna be <laughs> fine. I'll save you, I won't okay. let Klaus get you. I felt comforted, though. That yeah, was there good. you go. That was good. And then Catherine. Do you really want me I to need bite you? Oh, yeah, I could take that. Oh. oh, God, that was good. That was good. And then you're satisfied after Catherine. I'm satisfied. Well, I've Catherine's never, been never bitten, gonna be satisfied. Never been bitten on this show, which is an, a gift from Ian Summerholder last year. What so is I that? don't know if you'll top this. I think he suggested he may have stolen this box from your dressing room. Some fan had oh, sent no. it to you, and he said, "I really want you to have it." But this is for Vane. That's for Vane, and I just bit you. You did. Oh no. So you're gonna die. You are gonna fall apart now. Oh no. But it's if I. Now, I would like to talk to Nina Dobrev so that I see if she can pass the Vervain test. <sighs> right, here I am. Right, she's here. <laughs> Ian gave you yeah. that? That's, that, wow, that's Isn't awesome. this beautiful? That's really cool. You know? That's and really I, cool. I said to him many, many times after he did the interview, when are you sending me the Vervain? And he said, we're very busy. Well, you we're running in circles, as I now find out. You know what? You interview a lot of vampires. I've noticed... Um, I mean, you've had Ashley Green and Willem Dafoe and Chloe up on me? and wow. Ian and I. Chloe so, and yeah. The, yeah. So you do you ever Baby get sick vampire. of never of of interviewing vampires? Cause never. What well, had a lot of everybody us. from the, this is my obsession show. So <laughs> really? the Twilight vampires, I don't really care. About. <laughs> They're too virtuous, and True Blood is getting like too much. But you guys can still be romantic. We try. Yeah, it happens. We really, really to, to have all that, the biting, the, and still be romantic, it's great. And, I mean, it's a love story at the end of the day, and it's as much as they are these mystical beings, they're trying to hold on to their humanity as much as they can. I mean, Damon. Well, who Damon this, like, sometimes is not so good at that. No, I mean, he, he, takes, he, takes, he takes a sip out of a couple of different people every so often. Um, <laughs> I mean, that, that was well, the most delicate way that I could say no, it. No, it is. It's like rehab. Everybody expects there's going to be a relapse <laughs> once in a while. Hopefully not a big one. Exactly. You know, that will happen that way. But, but when I look at that, what I'm seeing there is you are working every day with these two guys who are playing characters who are both crazy, rabidly mad in love with you. What happens if you give away a spoiler? Are you punished? Is everybody forced... <laughs> 
to just stay out in the heat in direct sunlight <laughs> in Atlanta until they say never again. I wish it was that easy and that, that, that good. No, we get into a lot of trouble, I'm sure. I thankfully haven't done anything too bad as far as I know. So I well, that's so sad trouble. because I'm looking for something, a little nugget of something, not a spoiler, because who really likes that? But a spoiler? Um, someone's going to die. I mean, someone, someone always dies. It's a vampire show. But. Someone's going to die. Does the finale get set in some special place that we can look forward to? The end of the second season ends with a lot of tears because, like I just said, someone's going to die. Someone that, that you wouldn't expect. I'm getting very fascinated with Bonnie now because I really want to harness the power of thousands of witches. Right. You know? <clears throat> to force Hollywood to make better summer movies. But <laughs> I don't know. Don't I don't we all? know if it will work. You know, I just don't know if it will work. When, you, when the fans come up to you, yeah. what's the first thing they ask you? Which of the two boys is the better kisser? Oh, see, I wouldn't have asked that. You, I, I'd hope not. <laughs> no, so, if you're but now you raise it, so I've got to. Uh, Girl will never kiss and tell. I'll never forgive you for that. <laughs> you could have come up with, I know, but I don't. You know, this is it. I've got the ravine. Well, but speaking of which, I mean, if Ian's sending you special little gifts, mm -hmm. does that mean you have a special little relationship? Of course. It's just, it's. <laughs> <laughs> Who else has sent me Vervain? Nobody, you know. I'll be waiting. I'll for trump this him. Thing. How about that? Can you? Because I think that would really annoy him. I'm still waiting for him to send a question for you, and I'm checking. But no, he is. He's dropping the ball. Wait a second. Wait a second. Uh oh. It's a challenge, and uh, it'll be a good challenge. From Ian? Oh, yeah. Ooh. Something he did when he was here. All right, so as we get to the end of this interview, it always comes back to music. It always comes back to, I have a guitar as it should, here Rolling for you. Stone. I've got drums. You can sing. You can wow. sing something that got sung to you when you were a kid. Okay, well, how about this? How about Ian took the drums well, off? Well, here's his question, by the way. Oh, really? Ian Summerholder's question that I've asked him now for 24 hours to come <laughs> up with is make her, listen to that, not persuade her, not to convince her, make her play the drum, but better than me, which won't be hard, <clears throat> but that's like begging for praise. That's like him saying, <laughs> no, you really played them really well. But, oh, I, uh, I don't play them really. I no, mean, but not... he wants praise for having really done it well. Huh. Now, you could, to be better than he is, sing which while I you am. play it. Oh, yes, really? There it is, yes, and that he was afraid to do that. That's a lot of pressure. Yes. I'm going to one-up Ian and you and the request and the demand. And I'll hold the vervain. Well, hold the vervain. <laughs> <laughs> um, I'm going to play the drums while it's not only singing, but like munchkin singing. How about oh, that? The best. I'm going to be a munchkin. I can't, this is going to be the best. Time. All right, ready? It's going to be like <laughs> an so elbow. Yeah. So. <laughs> never, never since and never again. That was so great. <laughs> Joy, 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 joy,